The sun was bright and the temperature was rising as my canine bodyguards and I set off to climb the Appalachian Trail from Big Stony Creek to the crest of Peters Mountain. I then walked to the Groundhog Trail, which comes up from the Monroe County side to meet my friend who had gone to visit the anti-pipeline tree sitters. I knew the 1500 foot climb would take the aging me at least two hours, and then at least another two hours to walk the 3.9 miles on the crest of the mountain. The Appalachian Trail ascends past the Big Pine Swamp Shelter surrounded by rotten fallen trees killed by gypsy moths, then follows Pine Swamp Branch through rhododendron thickets where Addie, a Labrador reincarnated, sloshed through the water, and Trey, who hates wet feet, crossed on rocks. Then along switchbacks across the face of Pine Swamp Ridge, over a swag between ridge and mountain, and to the junction with the Allegheny Trail, its southern terminus. We passed numerous through hikers and early wildflowers were in bloom. Several species of violets, star chickweed, wild geraniums, dwarf iris, white trillium, and toothwort. The massif of Big Mountain was to our left, seen through the trees. We went over and around knobs, had a long descent where the broad crest of the mountain is studded with large rock blocks into Dickinson Gap, then a climb over two knobs that show on the map and several smaller ones that don't. It was hot and the dogs and I were flagging when we reached Groundhog Trailhead, where my friend's pack was leaning against the sign, and she took a happy photo of me, tired and sweaty. It had taken five hours. But I love to get out in the woods and I try to explore a new place every weekend.